What's up, gamers? Welcome to another episode of our Mega Build Let's Play. I believe we're on like 58 now, if I'm not. If I'm, yeah, I think we're on 58. How the heck are you doing today, dude? How are we doing today? We were playing this last night and we blew up the birdhouse. It was hilarious. Uh, if you didn't get a chance to see that short, I'm going to link it below uh, so you can check it out. It's pretty, it's pretty funny, man, but... Yeah, more or less uh, what I'm going to do here, because after, I don't know, like it was like an hour later. Uh, it was after when I was supposed to end stream, but we were playing and, and uh, I was building this wall and the game crashed. So now I have to go back and build this one again. But the roof is complete, by the way. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool, but we are going to... Do that and get us the rest of this roof started working on here. Um, get working on these other bird holes. That's the plan at least. We'll see if we can actually do that. Oh man, of course, I was about to say that'd been sick if I actually hit that one. Okay, so we're gonna have to build some sort of scaffolding thing here to, in order to actually be able to work on this thing so unless 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 i can do all right hold on let me take a quick mental picture of what we got going on on this side um so we got the five we got the four which i've got that we got the five and the four there so we do two Angled ones and then three tall, two angled ones, and then three tall. So maybe I can jump up here on the wall corner. And can I jump from one to another? I can. Okay, that's a cool plan then. Uh, first, let's actually sleep. Let's sleep first because it's getting dark. Holy crap, man. Hopefully everybody's having a good day. Last night's stream was insane. If you didn't get a chance to stop in, man, make sure you check the link in the description uh, for my Twitch. Look at that, dude. Looks nuts. Looks nuts. I wish it was a little more centered on the top, but you know, it is what it is. It's kind of a crooked tree, so I'm not too concerned about it. Uh, let's get the rest of this out of here. And yeah, we're totally, we're totally crafted up on what ash we do have currently. So hopefully 63 is enough to complete this. I doubt it, but we'll give it a swing anyway. Luckily, it's only one piece per, you know what I'm saying? So it's not too bad. Um, craft, let's see here. Let's go ash wall angled. Here we go. All right, so we do that, and then we come up three, right? Isn't that the isn't that the plan? So I can't actually jump high enough to do that part. That's okay. We'll we'll just do it this way. Complete it, jump up, build it, jump up, build it, you know. Do like that. Okay, so this is two, so this is three. This will be the third and final one. Come on. Maybe. It's the final brain stem. All right, so that's the final. We can go back over here like this. And then from here, we have to get creative. Um, so let's do this number and we'll grab this and we'll flip it upside down like that. Okay, perfect. Okay, and then we'll do the same thing here, like that. Hopefully that's the right uh, orientation. I think it is. All right, so that's our two angles. So now we should be able to just carry this over. One, two, three. All right, how much do we have left? I want to be able to complete the circle, although the outsides probably aren't going to look super awesome. Do I have my dandelion? I do. Okay, so right here, oops, wrong button. All right, so we go angle. Uh, let's flip it, okay, right there like that, and then right there like that. 
Okay, and then we'll go up three. So there's one. And, oops, wrong button. Two. And three. Okay, now that we're up here, we go one in and then an angled one. Hopefully my math is right here. That'd suck if I did it wrong and I had to redo everything. I'd probably just load my save, honestly. <laughs> it looks to be good. Okie dokie then. Oops. Okay, let's take a look at what we got here. Matter of fact, I should probably just fill all this in since I'm up here and can do that. Uh, bounce. And here. Okay. This is so sketch. This is the way it's gotta be. This is the way it's gotta be. Mega build see-through style. Okay. So we've got a whopping like one and a half roofs left here, I think. Ew. Running out of concrete. Only seven remaining. <clears throat> I'm actually going to go check the charcoal after this because I don't quite remember. Um, when's the last time I actually farmed for ash? I wish I could actually see it on the floor over there. That'd be dope. All right, so there be our second bird hole. Okay, so that looks good. Yeah, we just need one more row of full walls, and then I like. Oh, it's kind of annoying that some of them are flip flopped, but at the end of the day, whatever. That's a cool thing about big builds is you can make mistakes like that, and you can get away with it a little bit. I'm not gonna worry about it too much. Let's put all this back and that as well. Okay, so that's in there. That's in there. And, oh, I, stood it. I do still have nine pieces. Dang. Oh, well. Oh, well. Um, all right. Antlion armor. Let's go see. Did I get it on? Yeah, I did. Okay. Let's go see if charcoal has respawned. Let's go see if charcoal has respawned. Man, I did not sleep worth a crap last night. I woke up feeling like complete doo-doo. But I got my coffee. You know? So we're good. I really need to figure out exactly where I want zip lines to come out of this place at. I'm still going to build a balcony around the outside, so maybe that's maybe that's where they'll come from. Um, I have to figure the balcony part out though. I'm going to make like a two or three wide balcony all the way all the way out of it. All right, let's see if my charcoal has respawned. I kind of got it at the beginning of the stream last night, but I don't know if it's respawned just yet or not. Um, yes, it looks like it has. Awesome. Awesome sauce. Here we go. Throw the hammer. Throw the hammer. Nice. This is my new favorite way to get this stuff. Throw the hammer and use my little macro to pick it back up again real fast. Ow, 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 ow. Please don't. Please stop. Okay, now stop burning for a second. I am a little low on the health. I'm going to try and stop by the healing pond here and hopefully get that squared away. Come on, throw. Throw! What are you doing? All right, to the healing pond. The pond of healing. All right, that only got us 11 chunks so far. Give me my buff. Come on. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Man, he was quiet. He didn't make a sound. What the heck? All right, give me the stuff. Give me the stuff. Where'd my hammer go? Give me the stuff. Come on, bro. Come on. Why is it not working right now? I 
feel like they nerfed me. They nerfed me, people. <laughs> I'm too strong. I'm too powerful. 16 with uh, big ol' two more chunks to go. This is actually... Oh, no, wait. I didn't do this one yet. All right, there's that one. I want to try not to take any sizzle damage if I can. Okay, there we go. There we go. All right, we're good. And luckily, the uh, healing pool buff is, is getting us healed. And we have an, a lovely fod here. A lovely fod. Okay, we're Gucci. We are Gucci Gucci. Big old snoring fella. All right, now that we got that made, um, I do believe I'm going to take... I need more clay. I'm out of clay up there. Here's the brat burst responsible for blowing up my base last night. <laughs> it was epic, dude. I don't know if you guys were there or not. But, uh, yeah, once we, once we completed the roof, I decided I wanted to... Ooh, that was a close one. Don't come back. Don't come back. Uh, I decided to blow it up because you know it only has one point of attachment on that on that mushroom right there. So yeah, it exploded and and it broke my game a little bit, but it was still pretty cool. It was pretty cool. It almost seems like the birdhouse is bigger than the crane. It's definitely bigger than the pyramid. I don't know, man. That crane is a, is nuts. The crane is nuts, and this birdhouse is nuts. It really is. I can't wait for it to be done. We got a nice little roof overhang here. <clears throat> Imagine if this was a pyramid, like that went all the way to the ground. Holy crap. That would be crazy. That would take like years to do, I would assume, because the further down you go, the longer the rows take to get completed. All right, so I can go ahead and grind this stuff up, but I don't believe I have the clay I need to make it into wall pieces. And honestly, I'm probably not going to worry about it too much because uh, at this point, it's just going to be at this point, it's just going to be, you know, like hurry up and wait type of thing. Um, but I might be able to maybe work on this balcony around the outside. Go ahead and take all the plant fibers out. No plant fiber in there, none in there. Okay, let's craft all of this. Let's see if I can come up with a way to do this whole balcony idea. All right, let's take it out. Uh, let's say in reference to the height of this thing, let's say four. Four is probably a safe bet. And we could take it f this way to connect up with the flat piece there. And I think more or less what we're probably going to end up doing is come out four on all the sides and then connect the corners because that seems about the best way to do it. Hmm. So like now that I'm thinking about this, I also have to consider the fact that I'm going to be making Let's see here. All right, let me destroy this and that. And this and that. Yeah, mushroom wall, yep. Okay. Ash wall here. I'm kind of trying to figure out how I want to do the bird posts. You know what I'm saying? Like the post where the bird would sit if if he did sit. I just dropped some concrete down there. That sucks. So what I'm curious of is if maybe I put a angle wall. Let's see here. Let's mess with this idea real quick. Because what I don't want is for the post to get in the way of the 
balcony, so I might have to drop the balcony down one one row. So I want to make sure that I can figure this out first. And I still don't really know how I want to do this, so... Where is the mushies? Flip it upside down. You go right there, you go right there. Okay, so if I was to do it like this, and we would probably, let's see here. What could I do instead of floors, 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 floors? Hmm. Well, because see, this would look good, but the only problem is, is I don't think we can do... Yeah, the roof, it would have to look like this. And then we would have to do walls like that, and then probably wood walls on the sides. Stem walls like this. They actually might... Oh yeah, they're supposed to be half walls, though. I'm like, why does that look so tall? Okay. Like that. Is that good? You guys like that? I kind of like that. Um, and it gives me a reason to use my crow feathers. It might be a little large compared to the bird hole, but maybe not. Maybe not. We'll take it out like maybe 10. Let's get let's get some materials together here. And let's complete one of these little bird holes or whatever. <clears throat> the bird hole post stick thing. See how far out we should take it. And I should get... I don't know if I got any bird feathers up here or not, but this will give me a good reason to use my crow feathers. I did use them on Founders Hall, but, uh, okay, I don't have any extra there. So let's go get our crow feathers real quick. Um, I have a feeling I'm going to do something different with this. Oh. There we go. Let us see if I have any crow feathers available. Oh, I don't have my speed boots on, man. Wait, is there clovers in here? Okay, no. Alrighty then. Stay away from me, spoiler. Oh, you're in the ground. Yay. Love that. Love that for us. Okay. I don't have a ton, but, you know, whatever. Could add them as I go. 54. I mean, that's still a pretty good chunk. <clears throat> That's about 20-something roofs, which should be enough to complete at least one of these little footstand things. I'm excited about this, dude. I want you guys to, uh, so instead of doing a word today, <clears throat> I want you to drop in the comments something cool you think they should add to the game that you would like to see. I'm like, I'm like dead set on colored mushroom blocks now. I'm so dead set on colored mushroom blocks. I hope that becomes a thing, man. Because just imagine like being able to dye mushroom blocks like any color. That would change everything. <clears throat> that would literally change everything. Quite literally. Okay, let's put this here, and let's see what we can come up with here. How far out do I want this to go? Maybe five? Yeah, if I'm going to do the balcony four, um, I think five here is probably okay. Maybe. The bad thing is, is we're going to have to uh, kind of get a distant view of this in order to see if it's even going to even going to look good. Did 
Dang, I can just use every one of them sticks. Holy crap. It's a very stick heavy little thing there. Um, here, let me get my right armor on. And that. There we go. Now we can take this, put this here, take that. Okay. It's too bad we don't have glass either. Glass would be kind of cool addition, really. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, like that. Now the question is, do I leave them open and these are the entry points for the zip lines? Or do I close them off? That is the question. That is the question. Hmm. That's a good question too, really. Um. Freaking itchy nose. Itchy, itchy nose. All right, so G like this, like that, and then Ash. Where's the Ash at? Okay. That ought to look kind of cool. I don't know if I've got all the stuff to complete these couple little bit of walls right here. Nope, I sure don't. I sure don't, but that's okay. I don't know if I've got any mushroom blocks over here or not. I'd like to complete it and then kind of take a step back and look at it and see see what it looks like. Um, all right, there's all our ash, which I can't cook this up until I get some charcoal. So, or not charcoal, clay, Jesus. Um. Okay, let's get some clay real fast. Ain't no point in waiting around. I don't see any feathers over there. I'm gonna have to start scouting out for feathers. I usually see them like in my town, right? This is another big reason why clearing out the whole entire yard of grass is gonna be a cool thing because, you know, for bird feathers, I'll pretty much be able to see them anywhere but at the same time the render distance for bird feathers is is weak sauce dude weak sauce on the render distance for bird feathers i swear these dudes just spawned bro these guys just spawned this is what we call weevil town down here this is weevil town <laughs> Um, do I have any clay? I do. Cool. Perfect. Old Weevil City down here. Weevilton. Ha! <laughs> All hail Weevilton. What's up, bird? It's gotta be named Weevilton. Jinkies. Yeah, dude, like it doesn't render from a certain, like I can't see it right here. Like we're literally looking at it. I don't see the bird roofs. That's kind of really bad. Everything else renders except for the bird roofs. They still are not, okay, they finally rendered. God, that's going to look like shit from a distance, man. Why does that happen? I'm assuming the bird roofs like, you know, are highly more detailed than the clover ones. Really makes me wonder if I should use clover roofs. I don't know. You guys let me know what you think, if it if you think it matters or not. Alright, let's cook this. Cook that up. Um oh I do still have a little bit more right here, anywho. Oh wait, do I have mushrooms? Dude, I'll be mad if I don't have mushrooms. Oh my god, dude. I don't even need mushrooms. Sorry, maybe I won't use mushrooms for the for this bottom. I'll just fill it all in with ash. Just fill it all in with ash. Okay, you go right there. 
You go right there. Okay. Good enough for me. Let's go peep it and check it out. Let's go peep it out. Um, Where do I want to go for the peepins? We'll just go this way. Somewhere over here. I mean, it looks like a cylinder, right? It do be looking like a cylinder, though. Which is kind of the whole point of the thing. It do be looking like a cylinder. I almost feel like it needs to be twice as long. I don't know. I'm going to leave it just that way. And I'll let you guys chime in on what you think. And I wish it wasn't dark so I could see a little better. Um, here, let's go into photo mode. Let's go into photo mode and let's change the light. Mm. Oh, I wish we had more building block options. I do, I do. But here's what I'm thinking, man, is I think I dropped down like a wall or two from the bottom of this thing. And uh, we place platforms, and that's how we, we like drop it down. So it'll give it a little more depth on the bottom, I guess. Drop it down two walls, put a, put a balcony, go all the way around. And then that would be like the place, where, like if it had like a bird feeder on it, you know what I mean? Like that would be the place where like all the... All the bird feed is. Like the trough. I guess, yeah, it'd be more like a trough instead of a balcony. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think, man. I'm going to go ahead and kill this video. Um, wait, what the? Oh, okay. I know where this is. I'm about sick of these nose hairs, bro. I wish I could just, like, I wish I had the balls to get the freaking, like, wax stick thing and just rip all my nose hair out. It drives me absolutely crazy. But make sure you guys like this video for me and answer the questions in the comments. And I'll see you live on TikTok here in about an hour or so. Actually, by the time I upload this video, I'll probably already be live on TikTok. So if you want to come check me out, man, check the link in the description. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Pieces. Achoo!